Hi, welcome to Sunny's The Car Wash Factory. One of the questions we hear a lot around here is how do I properly wire my blower motor or one of my three-phase motors for pumps or blowers or vacuum cleaners? Um, again, rule number one, this is a job that should be done by a licensed electrician. Three-phase power is nothing to fool around with. It's not something that uh, any one of your techs should be doing. It should be done by a licensed electrician. But we do specify that all motors over 7.5 horsepower be wired with split pull connectors. Um, we have a lot of on-off cycles, so we want to make sure that the wires stay connected properly and they don't overheat and they don't get um, damaged or they don't short out. Number two, always use your lockout tag procedures. Don't ever touch a motor or wire on a motor unless you know that the unit's been turned off and the service has been locked out so that nobody can start it up on you while you're working on it. Uh, a couple things that we need to do this job is these are split pull connectors and that's what we're going to use and just demonstrate how they go on. Um, so you can make sure the electricians have done it properly if they weren't used to doing it. Split bolt connector is a small copper bolt split in half. It's got a little sleeve and a shoulder so it'll go in and tighten the, the wires up. You need electrical tape, standard black electrical tape. You need insulation tape. Insulation tape is not electrical tape. It's a little bit more thicker. It's not so tacky but it's designed to help protect and insulate the wires because they are going to get hot, those bare wires, and they're going to be, need to be protected otherwise they will melt and short out against each other. You need something to strip your wires with and uh, to get them together. So today I have one of them here already insulated. I have one here that's on the unit uh, loosened up. Uh, again, a couple of small wrenches is all it takes. And each one of these, depending on whether you're high voltage or low voltage, you need to buy the right Thomas Betts connector to handle the right gauge wire you're using for your unit. Again, the motor wire is always going to be the same, um, but depending on the voltage of your service, the wires feeding it will be a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller. So you, you may have to buy a different connector depending on how, how many wires you're putting together. Normally two, but in some wiring configurations you've got to put three of the motor leads together um, to make that connection proper. So once you've tightened it up, then you take your insulation tape, and it doesn't take a lot of this to do it because it does have some stretch to it, and basically we want to take this unit we want to wrap this unit up completely so that we have a nice tight seal and we have enough insulating rubber around this unit so that it's protected as good as it was in the wire casing. After we do that there, we grab uh, the electrical tape. The electrical tape then goes around this little ball and if you've seen this done in a supply unit or somewhere else, you, you'll recognize the look of what it looks like to be a, um, a nice tight wired connection that won't fail for a long time um, and it'll make sure that you don't have a short anywhere in the system. Um, so that is, looks like just insulated and then this here looks like uh, a nice tight connection, waterproof, watertight, not going to get hot, not going to short out against the box inside there. You've got to split your wires back enough to make sure they do it right. But if you open up your boxes or if you check and you have problems with motors shorting out or single phasing and the wire nuts are burning off, this is why we use split bolt connectors. So if you want to check on your electrician, make sure they're doing the right job, have them leave the boxes open, make sure they did it correctly, and then you'll have a long and steady life. Thanks for watching, and for more frequently asked car wash operation questions, visit us at sunnysdirect.com slash FAQ.